Gigi, I thought you were out running errands. That's what I'm doing. What are you doing? Me? Oh, I was just checking up on that waitressing job. You applied for it. Yeah, I told you that before. You didn't forget, did you? No, no. Just, I think Carlotta did. What do you mean? I came in here to, uh, you know, put in a good word for you. And the funniest thing, she said she never got your application. Carlotta didn't get my application? That's what she said. Hmm. I held one out. Oh, I wonder why she doesn't have it then. Maybe she lost it? Huh. Uh, oh, excuse me. Uh, my sister is interested in waitressing here. Oh, I'll get you an application. I mean, I really don't want to keep you. Oh, no, no, no. It's okay. Um, gotta make sure this one doesn't get lost, too. Jay, did I do something wrong? Like what? I don't know. Does this have to do with Rex? You think this is about Rex? Well, I just... Figured, you know, when you walked in on us earlier. Oh, uh, you mean when you were helping him stretch his back out? Yeah, he just looked kind of... What? Mad. <laughs> <laughs> what you saw was worry. Because he's been going through a tough time the last few days. Like what? I can't really talk about it. But that's why his back was stiff, and you helped him stretch. <laughs> so that didn't bother you? You're my sister. He's my boyfriend. I'm glad you two hit it off. Are you sure? I wouldn't have it any other way. Well, I'm finished. Perfect. Could you make sure uh, Carlotta or Noelle gets this? Because her other one got lost. Yeah. Thanks. Okay. Gigi! <laughs> Come on in. How are you? Good. I'm good. Okay. What's up? I don't know. Um... I just wanted to see how you're doing. Really? No, not really. I need a Paris, Texas coffee talk. Oh, honey, what's bothering you, huh? Um, I mean, how do you feel seeing her after all this time? It's great. It's great. Rex and Shane love her, and she's a lot of fun. And... But? I don't know. Yes, you do. She's my sister. <laughs> you think sisters aren't supposed to be upsetting? Ever met my sister, Tina? Talk about upsetting. And how about siblings from hell? <laughs> my brother is Todd Manning. Um, I guess Stacy hasn't really done anything wrong. It's just little things. Like? Like, she told me she applied for a job at the Buenos Dias. Uh, but when I went in to put in a good word for her, Carlotta told me she never got her application. Did you ask Stacy about it? Yeah, she said they lost it. And you don't believe her? <sighs> it's not just that. This morning, I came home from buying everyone breakfast, and I walked in, and her hands were all over Rex. She said she was helping him stretch, but... You don't believe that either. Not after I walked in our bedroom and I found her with her hand on his bare chest. Stacy was in your bedroom with Rex? She said she heard him having a nightmare, so she went in to check on him. And she did that by putting her hand on his chest? Yeah, and now I can't stop thinking about it. Okay. You know that Rex is crazy about you, right? I know he loves me. Yeah. And that nothing Stacy does is going to change that. Right. He doesn't even seem to notice. <laughs> See? Oh, God, it's just... Oh, there's just something about her. I haven't seen her in all these years. Well, she's not a little girl anymore. No, she's not. She's so different. It's like getting to know someone new. And you're not sure you like her. I'm such a bad person. No, you are not. So what do I do? Because I don't trust my own sister. Listen, kid. If not trusting your own sister makes you a bad person, then there's no one worse than me. <laughs> so what do I do? 
What do you do? Well, that's not really uh, an easy answer. How do you deal with Tina? I don't anymore. After this last time, I told her I never wanted to see her again. The problem is, I still worry about her. Uh, and I guess I will never really give up on her. So that means I should... That means you, darling, should watch your back. Well, thanks for the Paris, Texas coffee talk. Anytime. You're so welcome. Take care. Bye. Bye, honey.